stems. Let's watch how the stem of a plant acts like a straw. What happens when you pull liquid through a straw? The liquid goes up. The water that is in the soil needs to go from the roots to the leaves and the other plant parts. The stem lets it travel through just like a straw until it reaches the leaves all while also acting like the backbone or the spine of a plant. Just like your backbone keeps you straight up, so does the stem. Think about if the plant didn't have a stem. What would it look like? Can you guess stems that you might eat? What do you think this is? Asparagus is one yummy stem. What is this stem? Celery is another stem that you can eat. This is what celery looks like at the grocery store. What part do we cut off before eating? The leaves. This is what celery looks like when it's in the soil. If you want to do a fun experiment to see how water travels through celery, first get food coloring. Definitely ask an adult. You can change the water in different bottles to different colors using food coloring. Add in the celery. You will get to see how the water travels through the stem up to the leaves. Check out how the red food coloring traveled from the stems to the leaves. It completely changed the leaves colors. Is the stem an important part of the plant? Yes.